hours in less than 5 minutes. So the things you need are some cloth, paper towels, microwave safe, heavy bowls, fresh flowers. So let's get started. Fold your cloth and then place some flowers on one side. Now place a paper towel on top so it will absorb all the water. Now fold it back again. Place your flowers into the microwave and then take the heavy bowls and place it on top. Microwave it for 30 seconds. If your flowers are big, uh, microwave it longer. We microwaved our flowers for a total of 2 minutes and 30 seconds. With these dry flowers, you can make cards, frames and bookmarks. But today I will be making a frame. The things you need to make the frame are a canvas. I got my canvas from Artworld. Some glue, a paintbrush, some crayons. I got these awesome crayons from Cut and Craft. If you do not have this, you can use paint, some water and my pressed flowers. So apply your art crayon on your canvas. Dip your fingers or paintbrush into the water and then gently spread it out. It's better to use your fingers while blending. I just now finished the canvas. Now I'm about to take these beautiful pressed flowers and do amazing layout and then I'm going to stick my flowers. Lightly uh, stick my flowers. Now to seal it, we're going to make some mod podge. Take your very own mod podge. You need 100 ml of Chemifix, 50 ml of water, Pour it into a jar and shake it well and there you have it, your own Mod Podge. Completely coat your frame with the Mod Podge. frame it has to dry a little bit more and I also did these cards uh, please give it a go and if you do please tag us and we will repost your creation we also got the flowers from Shiru Shiruhana hope you enjoyed this DIY until next time